Yeah, all right, shall I want? First and foremost, I would like to begin this lesson by giving all praises. Or and glory to Yahweh, Yahweh Basha me out shy, Basha me kakodash, and double and also the apostles and elders of great millstone that rule well. Peace and blessings to the elect. And um, this year is Ama One from the Great Millstone Camp in Trinidad. Coming back to do another edification. You know, hopefully, that you find through the Spirit. And power of Yahweh by Shami You know, and um, I'm in transit at this moment. And um, <coughs> yeah, I just wanna. So I'm always just meditating, you know. Is that is that scene? But I, but I is like the world we live in in that way, you know. But we did just see, but it's only in this world because in our kingdom, that would be a. We did just say brutally honest and and sweet lies. If I if I could be brutally honest, brutally honest with you. But then when they say he's talking about lies, they say sweet. Yeah, son. Brutal honesty. Like if you was in a sentence, I go say, um, that, that, in, in the um, he did, he, if he was in an interview, he was being brutally honest about his views on the particular um, thing where he was talking about. All right. But then they the say when it when they're describing lies, sweet lies. So brutal honesty and sweet lies. So that is this world really and truly, you know, because in our kingdom you ain't going the true thing honest being honest is not really brutal. It will be brutal because you, you don't want to get your, your feelings being hurt. Alright? Your feelings being hurt to so the so, cause if 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 let me say let me say your your your, your wife right, have oh, an affair, she she stepping out, and 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 you you will want she to be brutal, you will want she to be honest with you, not brutal. If she stepping out and she you're confront she and you, you're getting some suspicion about it, you would want her to be honest with you. You should want her to be honest with you. So that, not, that is not brutal. Alright? That is not brutal. Lies are brutal. Because it destroys. Alright? It breaks down. But you see, people love lies. They hate the truth. So the truth would become brutal to them. So like us, we know down the highways and the byways. And declaring this word is is the, is is us being very honest, is us being truthful to this world. That truthfulness is brutal because what the scripture says in John chapter three and nineteen that light is coming to the world, and men love darkness rather than light because their deeds were evil. Men wicked as hell, so they don't want to hear the truth. It's brutal to them. But really and truly, in our kingdom, lies would be brutal. If 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 that people was to lie, that is the brutalness. Because our kingdom would be, or because truth, honesty is a lovely thing. Honesty is a, is a virtue, a good virtue. That is a good virtue for, for, for men to have. To be honest in life. To be truthful. Alright? But the so-called white man, because he's such a demon, he, made, or he makes honesty to be a bad thing. White men being honest. And being honest, that is brutal. Consider people's feelings. Look, scripture say, cry aloud and spare not. Psalms, look, look, Isaiah, 
Isaiah chapter 58 and 1 Lift up thy voice like a trumpet And show my people their transgressions And the house of Jacob their sins And that In order for us to do that We have to be honest Now if you're willing to take reproof Honesty Is a lovely thing Yeah I tell you that in Proverbs I'll try and see if I can get one Proverbs, Proverbs chapter 9, right? Right. And 7. It says, He that reproveth a scorner, get it to him, self shame. And he that rebuked a wicked man get it himself in blood. Verse 8 says, Reprove not a scorner, lest he hate thee. And rebuke a wise man, and he will love thee. You see? Be, when I want to rebuke you, when I get rebuke, that is the truth. Then. Now your feelings go come out. Then you will feel that kind of you feel that you gotta put you gotta put a side feeling put that pay 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 emotions to the side you gotta put that to the side buddy and get rebuked you don't feel good how the fuck how, how that gonna feel good but you can't study the flesh feeling bad you see because that man rebuke who rebuke and you're being honest with you and that is a true brother you know that to be honest with somebody you're being brotherly to them so it should be lovingly honest and brute or sweetly honest and brutalized but that but that's world let's world upside down you see that why um, Isaiah 20 well, 29 and, and um, 16 Surely your turning of things upside down shall be esteemed as the potter's clay. This world is upside down, so it will look at a man with an honest trait, a good, a, a wonderful virtue as honesty. They will say that he's being brutally, that is a brutal thing to say. Like when we say the Edomites going into slavery, we are telling the truth. But you're going to have men like Volker Malone. Who fine we shouldn't say that because that has hurt people's feelings. But it's the truth. Right? When we say um you woman, when we tell you so-called Negro woman, she she in this world she's nothing but a, a, a whore. Right? That is when, when we tell her that we are being honest to her. The vast majority of them are just sluts and whores because of the culture that I grew up in yeah that, that is what this world taught them to be whores and, 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 and enough plenty of them just get in the feelings but when I when, when we tell you these things we not just telling you and leaving you like that we telling you like, I, we tell you, 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 you're not adulterer, you don't sleep with your neighbor, wife, what not, you know? You're not leaving it like that. We, we give you an alternative to turn from that. Our Lord and Savior, you have a shire mashiach. Now, if you don't want to turn from that, you, you receive the truth, you receive the honesty, the love that was being shared to you, that is on you. You understand? It will just be destroyed. And when we tell men that will be destroyed, the same shouldn't be saying these things because we go hurt people's feelings. We really don't care about people's feelings. All right. So it, it should be it should be sweet honesty and brutal lies. And that's the world we live in. Let me be honest. Uh, Try to be as, as, as I mean, I, 
as, I mean, I, I want to see brotherhood. I want to see Akiam. Because it, it go hard. It go hard. It's like be real. We ain't going concerning this doctrine. We talk the truth always. But it, 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 there's human beings. There's flesh. You might have your girl. You might lie to your woman. Something like that. You know, if you have... <laughs> like, if you say I have an ex woman, or you know, a ex a little side piece, you know what she don't know about you was working, yeah, babes, I was working late, whatever. I just say it now, eh? and that's what we had to do deal with in this world. I'm not even supposed to be going through and hiding in the next woman, but hey, I just say it now, eh? me, I being real with Jimmy personally, I don't have time for all them to that fucking girl and them. tell it to be honest. I do really don't have time for that. I'm my young days and for, since I, I, I glad I just had the truth, you know. But to be honest, is a is a good trait. That 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 shouldn't be, that shouldn't be brutally honest. I, that that's like a fucking. I don't like that. I don't like that statement. See somebody when they say he's being brutally honest. Why? Because you go hurt some feelings, you should you should take that and look at yourself. That's what this world need. This world need honesty in it and more reproof. And that's what we doing. Because it was, it was uh, uh, hey, why are you mad? All kind of people just do you know the one. The world mad. The crazy yo. It need balance. And that is what our Lord and Savior Yahweh, Bashami Yahweh is coming back to do. He's coming to put balance in the world. The right balance back. Balance it. The way it's supposed to be. Because right now it's not the way it's supposed to be. It's in a fucked up state. A very, very effed up state. Alright? You have these so-called white people ruling who Mr. Foka Malone definitely don't want to be uh, uh, enslaved. Like this brother, the brother from the Virginia camp when he was bringing out all the atrocities and ill treatments that was done that was factually done not 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 um Mystically done or, or mythically done. The atrocities that was done to the so-called Negroes were, were factual. And the and the and the, the brothers from Virginia and Vocab came up, creep up on them like a like, like a always creeping up on you. You, you can't just be creeping. I don't we don't creep up on you know on vocab or anything, we don't creep up on it. And that's invade them. I don't see brothers doing that. But he just creep up on here and, and the brother the brother was bringing out all the ill doings that was done to the so-called Negroes on the side. Vocab Malone just pushed that to the side. So why you must just push that to the side? So who so who is so who is we? Who who is? We is nobody then. So so you, you you keep coming up to the camps and engaging with brothers in conversation. So and then and then it's still in the, in, 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 the, in the end of the day looking down on brothers as nobody then. Looking down on the so-called Negro man who you're engaging in conversation with. Biblical conversation, you're still looking down on them as, as a nobody then. Because when he when he bring out them them atrocities that was done, you did absolutely nothing to say, yeah, that was real bad, but I'm really sorry to hear that was going on the You just Man, just push that to the side and say, I can't remember exactly what he says. So, we are, we is nobody. We is just like, just drop on the earth and yo, that, that wrong. You see, these nations and that, everything that we teach is biblical prophecy. Can I read Revelation 11 chapter and it says, Yet dead bodies shall lie in the street. Which spiritually is called Sodom and Egypt, where also their Lord was crucified. 
Alright? And, and and that's Saddam and that Egypt and the, and the dead bodies going back to Ezekiel Ezekiel 37 chapter. Alright? That is the dead bodies. Shall line the street. Right? In the place that is called Saddam and Egypt because Jake over there over here on this western hemisphere they be real we could because he quit those two ancient kingdoms those two ancient places with what is going on over here the traits Egypt Saddam because I mean the colorful people the, the rainbow people that's Saddam Egypt because of the bondage that we serve and a whole heap of other things. Yeah, the Obelix, the Old Sinai, the pyramids on the American dollar, all these things go straight back to Egypt. And it says we all saw our Lord was crucified, crucified, meaning that our Lord on this side was exed out. Because that is what the word crucify means. You have a shy's doctrine and, and you have a shy's image was X'd out over here. Crucify him here. So that is that is what it means, right? And then it go on to say you read a couple of verses and then it go and then it go on to say in, in a, I believe verse eleven that um, after three days and a half the spirit of life which is prophecy from the most I entered into them right and they stood on their feet and ex I, I, I'm going to be misquoting it and they stood on their feet an exceeding great army and great fear fell upon them which saw them so what going on right now is the army is being built on thy prophecy right Get with the apostles, the elders, all the way down. We are the brothers who building this army. The other artist in Jamaica, his name is Chronix. He sing this song. Here comes trouble. Here comes danger. Sent by the sent by the Rasta youth. He say, I and I start recruit. Soldiers and he says a lot, you know them Rastafarians. And he say what he say? He say recruiting soldiers for the army. For 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 Selassie army, right? But the, when you when you watch the music video for that song, it's just such a dirty Bobo Dread the Rast dirty and the standing up in the video so with a face serious. I say what the fuck? What kind of army is that bro? <laughs> I don't know army. Who you go and fight with the army? To, to take down Babylon. The Rastafarianism is bullshit. Eh? And anybody who follow me, listen to what I say. Rastafarianism is bullshit, man. That thing is shit. That's not, that not even real, bro. That fucking army. Um, Like Isogi or that, 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 that doctrine, man. That ain't no real doctrine, man. So I say, I ain't no God, man. But the real army, the army, the true army, is being raised up. I'm sure about that. Yeah, I'm sure about that. The true army is, 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 the, is the men, the 144,000 men. Yeah, you should watch that video with Chronix. Chronix is a Jamaican artist. He's saying, here comes trouble. Here comes the danger. Yeah. The danger. He's he recruiting soldiers for the army. I set a, set a dirty, a, I set a dirty Shiva Jatas um, wearing Benjamites in the video. He, 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 he had dirty, yo. He cut off the out of the head. What the hell, yo? I said, what the hell? But the true army is the prophets, bro. The, the, the 144. Alright? 
And that is who the Lord is, 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 is um, waking up in these last days to fight the war. And the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, right? But mighty through the Most High to the pulling down of strongholds. That is 2 Corinthians chapter 10 and 3. And go down. Casting down imaginations and every high thing that exalted itself against the knowledge of the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son. Right? So, the true army being raised up. And that is what getting these Edomites like Vokawa and them. You see, you can't really stop what's going on here. Bro, they tried to stop that years ago, bro. Truth don't die, bro. They didn't think with truth. It cannot die. They killed it already. Right? They tried to kill it. Yeah, I was shy. I referring to. Here's the truth. They tried to kill the truth. And it just raised back stronger. You truth, the truth don't die. Yeah, I was shy. It's the truth. The truth don't die, bro. They, they literally tried to kill the truth. The truth, the truth. They thought they put the truth to death. You got by killing your murdering our Lord. Right. Everything sealed they know. Can't come back. But the truth just rise back up stronger and rise up. It rise back up immortal now. Oh, cool. You can't kill it. You can't kill the truth. And I will focus up and I'm trying to do. Kill the truth. Right, when, when he come out and come to try and disrupt brother's teaching or make a video you can't tell me bro it's hot watch during the pandemic during the whole the 19 business the number 19 this man hardly do videos concerning nana and what going on in the earth you know? all you studying is Israel right Studying Israel so far, right? What are you studying Israel so far, right? You do videos on the world. If you are, if you believe it's a teacher in scriptures, do videos on things that are going on in the world. All your focal point is on Israel, Israel, Israel. What Israel do you why? Can I sleep? And for a man to have all that zeal behind Israel because he gained money, eh? straight up, eh? you, one thing you can't constantly be going and getting cut in one thing over and over and over. And, nobody don't believe in Jesus Christ so much, bro. No fucking body. Because Volker Malone see it. He definitely see it. You can't be dealing with brothers for so long. And then see it, you see it. You can't tell me you believe in Jesus Christ so much. Now nah, you gain money. You have the driving force there now had to be money. Think about it, it had to make sense. Because you sure that when you go and engage, you go and engage in a conversation with them uh, Kim who you're going and meet, you're sure to go in and go in the scriptures and embarrass you. You know that. You can't be like an online embarrassment. You have to be getting something of something for that. So, uh, there's money he set up. He set up. He set up by CIA or whoever. Or if he's a direct. Um, what, what do you call it? A direct. What do you call it, boy? A direct disciple of the, of the Red Shield, the Rothschild. If he's a, if he's one of those, you know, like a, like them directly set him up and say go and harass, harass them, boy. because it had to make sense, boy. You can never like Christ so much, boy. You mad? Who does like? By the strongest Christian don't like Christ so much, boy. Uh, 
You know who will like Gray so much? He, ha- he just have a demon on fucking. He not too smart. That pop looking. Fuck it, um. Who does Just cross! And dancing. The Mexican now. <laughs> the psychotic Mexican. Yeah, he 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 go like him so much. He just have a demon on him, but Volker Malone and us, he smart. He no no he no no idiot. He intellect. He smart. He, he he's not a dunce. He not a dummy. Right? I ain't gonna say he's the he's the brightest bulb in the in the room, but he knows something. He not he's not he's not the smartest guy. He don't understand the prophecies, but he. he read right he could understand when he read what he reading so he see it he definitely saw what we teaching and he know what we teaching is the truth and he know it makes sense he, he read the curses of Deuteronomy and you could never read them curses up in Deuteronomy and just even if you don't really want to if you, if you don't really want to why is reading them curses it literally spelling out them so-called Negroes, them Latinos, them Native Americans. It's telling you that. Even if you don't want that knowledge at all, it's telling you that straight up. You understand? Even if you don't want that knowledge, them curses telling you straight. You know, that, that, like them people, boy. That is them, boy. And he read that. He definitely read the, through, through them curses for sure. <laughs> for sure he read them curses. For sure. And when is he reading it? You feel the thing called crossy part? Them men making sense. Them men making sense, boy. Hey, I seen a number played with 1948. What happened in 1948? Huh. That is, that is not the spread well, then I don't know. 1948, and I now talk about the, the Rush Shiesty. What happened in 1948? Look at now pulling in front of me. Because I'm on the highway right now. What happened in 1948? What happened in 1948? Some big significant thing happened in 1948. And Volker Malone is a, is a 1948 bro. He is a 1948 He is a small hat. He is. He is that. And. Hey, look, nine, look, number no, plate in front of me here. 1948. Them small hats on them found their way into our land. Alright. Ezekiel 35 and 36 and 5. Right? Ezekiel 36 and 5. They found their way into our land and, and started to call themselves us. The joy of all they had. He's a 1948er huh? and he's set up, I believe. He had, he had to be getting money for that. You have to be getting money. But TD Jakes don't like cry so much, right? To the point where I right, you go you gain money from teaching Christ, right? But if you if TD Jakes constantly going around men and men disproving Christ them at some point it go fucking ponder yeah, boy. You can never have all that drive just so right? we 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 believe in your house shy mashiach definitely and nobody and this is this is why we will continue one four four day two as I now say that. This is why we will continue because we standing on something solid. We know when we speak, we have a, we, the Lord say, Luke 21 and 15, 
I will give you a mouth and wisdom which none of your adversaries shall be neither to able to gain sin or resist. So when we keep engaging in conversations, when we when we dialogue, when we go out on the highways and the byways, men come up to the camp. Alright? And we see more and more that, that, that they cannot disprove us that builds our faith more and more. And we see more and more that yeah, we we had the truth, right? We have it. They don't have it. We have it. Right? Them don't have the truth. We have the truth. And we, we get more stronger in the faith because now, hey, the Lord bless us. Alright? That is what we get. The Lord really bless you, right? God really bless us, man. Second Corinthians 4 and 7, we have this in earthen vessels. These bodies. Right? So, that is why, but when you constantly getting cut, 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 and you, re- you will always eventually realize you're not standing on f- on, on holy ground, on, on, on solid ground. You're not. And when you realize you're not standing on solid ground, the only, t- the only something now had to give you the, the drive to continue. Something tangible. Something tangible had to give you the drive to continue because you know every time you go and engage again, you're going and get cut again. So then why keep coming back? Because you're getting something tangible to continue. And that is fucking money or your, your livelihood because he's a, he's a small hat right he's a 1948 J <laughs> yeah I believe that I believe that a hundred percent Check this Archean series. Sell Archea. Oppose it. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, that has something giving you the incentive to continue in that vein. In that vein argument, and that had to be money. So, you know what? I, I reached down here to our brother doing the works. We just do the works on our Monday, but. We have something to do tonight, so we go and just do a little teaching all day, and then go and do what we have to do. Uh, so that give all praise there, Abba Basham, Now Shai, Basham, Rakhakodash, and double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that rule well. Peace, blessings, and salutations. <clears throat> Goes to the elect, Akiam Shalawam, and stay strong. You understand? Because we're almost out of here. This wicked, decrepit, demonic, evil, vicious, satanic, devilish, unclean, unrighteous, negative energy, filthy. Disgusting place. Yes, yeah, so shalom to the elect Akiam. Okay.